when we say endometriosis is the one of the most misdiagnosed, mismanaged, and mistreated uh, disease, I must say that the socio-economical factors have something to do with it. Here is why and how. If you are coming from low socio-economical group, it's easy to be treated and to be diagnosed as your ailment, as pelvic inflammatory disease. And if you have the privilege to go private doctors, then the diagnosis all of a sudden becomes irritable bowel syndrome that involves multi-specialty testing. In both ways, the diagnosis is wrong. And it, it is degrading for the first group of people to have a PID. They are put to shame. In fact, they do not have PID. And the second group, they, they develop mistrust to the whole medical community. So we develop one group of women with endometriosis from a different uh, origin, which both of them commonly share as mistrust to the whole medical establishment. And the, the resentment that develops, uh, the, the develops against this really formats these women's personality. I sometimes call this type E personality, a component of type E personality, because people with endometriosis have special personality, I think. Besides this, these women are sometimes high achievers in city crowd. They, don't, they can bury and hide their pain to the point when they cannot stand anymore. And years have passed. They're past the age of 30, 35. When you look at their inside, their endometriosis are so advanced. And the only treatment they may have, they may require is removing mass, uh, massively involving disease uh, containing and attacking their uh, tubes and reproductive functions.